the idea behind Digital Buddies was to actually bring people together, older people together, and a lot of people come in here and they, they have problems with the phones, they have problems with the iPads, they have problems with the laptops. They're very nice, they're, they're all very friendly, they don't at all make me feel stupid for not knowing something. They're very helpful. And they'll come in and think it's just them with that problem, and then they'll see other people do have problems just switching on a tablet that their children may have bought them. Now an iPad doesn't come with instructions and it's nice for them to come along to a session and witness other people struggling with the technology. What tends to happen is we have that problem to solve and we solve it together and the togetherness is the, the most important part. It does help to be in a that friendly, slightly informal atmosphere. I think gives anybody that confidence to ask a question, to know more. I've now been twice and I have found it helpful. You come away with the sort of initial experience and you feel more confident to, uh, to work it out yourself afterwards. It's nice to see people get something because sometimes you have to explain it you know, quite a few times but when you see like the light bulb go off it's a nice feeling because I feel like okay it does help someone today. It's not all of being about the, the actual technology itself it's about people coming together and kind of people just doing something. We've had a, a couple of ladies who formed a real strong connection, a real good friendship. And unfortunately one of them went into hospital a few weeks ago due to a fall and she's been in there longer than we've expected. We've made a group video and she was able to watch that and then she sent a video message back as well, which I think maybe before the project, I'm not sure she would have had, so I think that's worked really well. You can take part as much or as little as you wish to, but I think anybody could get something from the morning, even if you think you know a certain amount. Certainly if you're a complete beginner, somebody will help you through. A lot of people said to me before we came up with the idea of using this as an intergenerational project, younger people and older people don't get on. I found that to the contrary, that they're so interested about what each other's lives are about. And I've been amazed at the, some of the relationships that are built up between people in their, in their 80s and you know, younger people in their 20s. But the most fantastic thing about it is people kind of walking out through that door and thinking, I've had a good day today here. I've learned something I never thought I'd ever learn that. It's been a fantastic project all round really.